Hello, uh, today I'm going to uh, show you how to determine whether or not the following series is uh, convergent. And the series is sigma e with the power of n divided by n2 when n changes from 1 to infinity. Okay, so uh, there is a test saying that if if the limit a n when n goes to infinity if this limit does not exist or if it is not equal to zero you can conclude that the sigma a n when n changes from one to infinity this series is divergent okay is divergent so let's now calculate the limit of a n in this case which is equal to e with the power of n divided by n2 so the limit of e with the, with the power of n divided by n2 when n goes to infinity will be equal to so e with the power of infinity is infinity and n2 will be as well infinity okay so from the limit rule we know that uh, when limit fx divided by gx when x tends to a when this limit is equal to 0 divided by 0 or infinity divided by infinity one can, the, here in this case you can uh, conclude that the limit or you can say that limit fx divided by gx when x goes to a will be equal to limit derivative of fx divided by derivative of gx when x goes to a okay so here we can use this uh, rule basically to to calculate this limit okay as we showed already here the limit en with the power of n2 when n goes to infinity is equal to infinity divided by infinity that means uh, that means this limit that means this limit en with the power of n2 when n goes to infinity will be equal to the limit of the derivative of uh, en divided by the limit of the derivative of the n2 so derivative of en we know derivative of en is equal to en and derivative of n2 is equal to 2n when n goes to infinity but here if you put infinity here in the set of n that will be again infinity divided by infinity because e with the power of infinity is infinity two times infinity is infinity but the good news is, is the, again this rule is applicable here because as we said already when the limit of uh, a fraction is equal to zero divided by zero or infinity divided by infinity this limit is equal to the der limit of the derivative of the uh, numerator divided by the denominator okay so that means you need to take the derivative of this fraction one more time or the numerator and the denominator one more time which will be equal to the limit and goes to infinity e with the power of n the derivative of that is again e with the power of n and derivative of 2n will be 2 so this limit now will be equal to so n when n goes to infinity this will be infinity okay so this means the the limit of that series was this one that means the limit of en with the power of n2 or the limit of a n does not exist right so we said if the limit of a n does not exist or if it is not equal to zero uh, therefore that series is divergent and since in this particular case this limit does not exist therefore you can conclude that series is divergent i hope uh, you found this video helpful uh, please feel free to subscribe into this channel uh, if um, uh, you are interested so that you get updated when i upload new videos thank you